Hi team, welcome to Cloud Pandit. In this Microsoft Fabric Master Program, in today's session, we will talk about how to create Microsoft Fabric free trial without credit or debit card. Okay. So there are three simple steps you need to follow. One is we need to have a Outlook account. If you have it already, well and good. If you don't have, I'll show you how to create the Outlook account or Hotmail account also fine. The second step is we need to join the Microsoft 365 developer program where Microsoft is going to assign us the default domain domain ID. Okay, because without do domain ID with normal gmail.com, you can't log in. Okay, if you see all our log labs, we are uh, I am logging in with uh, at the rate cloudpandit.com, right? So that is basically my domain ID. But as you all don't have the domain, we will be logging into the Microsoft 365 developer program to get a random domain ID. Using that ID, we will be logging into the Fabric app. Once we log in into the Fabric app, we can enable the free trial. So let's get started. So I highly recommend to use the Microsoft Edge browser because this is a Microsoft browser which solves most of the problems. So as a first step, you can just type Outlook, sign up, click Microsoft account. Here, as you don't have any ID, just to say get new email. I'll be just saying cloud pundit ms okay fabric okay ms fabric cloud pundit ms fabric at the rate outlook.com if you want hotmail you can take it outlook.com click next so you can just type your password here next you can just give your the name here and just to give fabric click next so if you want to give the actual name that we have provided here so that is also fine, but this is not a, any restriction. You can give any name. Okay, so some data birth I am giving. Okay, but you can give your uh, data birth. Okay, you can give your data birth. Uh, the reason why you need to give right data birth is basically whenever account is locked, so you can able to unlock by providing the right data birth. Don't give random. This is just a public video. I am giving the random stuff. Okay. Now click next. So you need to do some kind of a verification here. You see. 3 into this image means 3 times this image should be there at the right image. See 2 times only it is there. Right? So here nothing. 0 times it's there. Here it is there 4 times I am seeing here. 1 time it is there here. Here none of the times. So here 3 times is there. This image 3 into this image means 3 times it is there. Submit it. So this should be there 2 times. If you see here only one time is there, here three times is there, here four times there, here two times is there, but make sure you have validated. So this is the right one. Okay, two times there, submit it. So next three into this means three times it should be there. Yeah, this is the place where we are seeing three, just to submit it. So verification is completed. You have proven you are a human, continue your action. Okay. Just make sure you have provided the right puzzle and all. In case if the puzzle is not working after trying multiple times, don't try with the same ID, just uh, uh, try with some other ID because uh, those are the some of the issues people will uh, report to us. Okay, so don't use that. So now, uh, so as we created the Outlook account, so we need to join the Microsoft 365 developer program. So again, I am going to the uh, Microsoft page. So here I can just click on this uh, developer program. So when I click on developer program, just to join now, click on the join now. Okay. So here you need to type the ID that you have created Cloud Pandit MS Fabric at the rate Outlook.com is the ID that I have just created. So now you need to provide your password that you have created there so i just signed up with that particular username and password click yes stay signed in okay. so here you need to just select your country you can just select india company name i'm just providing cloud pandit okay so language english i accept terms and condition i want to receive periodic emails about our Updates and all. This is not a mandatory field. If you want, you can just check it. If you don't want, uncheck it. Click next. Okay. So here, what is your primary focus as a developer? Applications to be sold in a market, custom solution for my own customers, applications for internal use at my company, personal projects. We 
want to do the personal touch. See, these all anything you can choose that will not make any uh, problem for us. But here, uh, so when you are joining the Microsoft 365 developer, you are interested mainly for the power platform. So you need to use this for Outlook. You want to use some other things, whatever you wanted to use. You can just uh, you can even check whatever you prefer to use. Just to save it. So what it is saying, welcome to the Microsoft 365 developer pro program. Just to click. So uh, it will show like this: Welcome, Cloud Fund is MS Fabric. So now we need to uh, enable, or we can say we need to set up our subscription. Just to click subscription. Instant sandbox means instantly they will assign the domain. Configurable sandbox means let's say gmail.com. You have purchased a gmail.com today. It will take 48 hours to sync up across uh, all the systems. So that's why it will take, you can see, it can take up to two days. For example, I have a cloudfunded.com, which is a domain. When I purchase, it takes two days for me to uh, sync up with all the things. So that's how if you want to configure your own sandbox, it takes some time. So that's why I want to go for an instant sandbox. Just click on instant sandbox, then click next. So here I need to set up the admin username and password. So admin username also same name I am giving cloud from this MS, MS fabric. The password I'm just setting up here. Okay. Just to confirm the password. Okay, I just set up the password. Your password must be between 15 to 20 characters. Okay, no problem. So if that is the case, I'll just uh, increase this particular number. Okay. So use alternative password for all the 16 fictional users. The default password for all fictional users in the admin password. So yeah, you can just if you want, you can just uh, use the some other password if you want to set up. You can use, but we don't require. We can able to use the same uh, admin uh, password. We can able to use. Okay, just click continue. So you need to give phone number. I'll be just uh, giving my phone number here. So when I give my phone number, I'll ask to send the code. Let's see. So it's going to send me the code now. Let me see. I have not received the code at Okay, so now I got the code. I'm just typing here seven three eight one two. Just to click setup. So this operation should take only about a minute. Just let's wait for a minute. Now you can see. Now you can see it got succeeded, and we are here. So if you see administrator ID, this is the administrator ID. What it has assigned. Okay. So 90 days it will be available. Okay. Free trial. So what you can do now, you can just keep these things here. You can just keep this particular thing here, and I have my password handy. So now the third and final step that we need to do is we need to log in into the fabric. Okay, let's log in into the fabric. So to log in into the fabric, what I will uh, suggest is I just go to the edge here. I just say app.fabric.microsoft.com. Okay, so here it is asking me to log in. I will be just giving this particular ID which I have taken from the developer program. I will just prefer to provide my username. And password okay i just provided the password now so it is saying cloud connect ms fabric action is required so you have 14 days until this is required so basically for security reasons it will ask you to enable the multi-factor authentication you can just enable the microsoft authenticator app or to your phone number for but we will do this later just to say ask later Okay, so it is taking us into the fabric portal now. So we can see, so it is just showing here. We are here right now. If you click on the right top here, you can see it is asking you to do you want to start your trial? Yes, just click on the start trial, start trial. Okay, when I click on the start trial, what it is saying successfully upgraded to a free Microsoft fabric trial. Just to cancel this. Now, if you want to just you can just go to our videos, you can able to see each and everything. So if you want to switch between the workspaces, you can create a new workspaces. Okay. 
So in order to see all the fabric uh, tab here, you just refresh this. Once you are enabled the free trial, you can just refresh this. So you can see Power BI, right? Just to click on the Microsoft Fabric, you can see all the tabs. So all the labs that we are doing is within the data factory. So now you just click on the data factory. This is how you can just come. Okay, let's say you can go to workspace, click on this workspace. From here, you can see different uh, like uh, like the storages or pipelines, okay, spark jobs, data warehouses, anything that you want to get, you can able to create it. It is very simple. So uh, what I suggest is one is once you create the, your Outlook account, once you log in, subscription may not be enabled immediately. So you wait for five, 10 minutes, your subscription will be enabled. The subscription I mean to say is developer program, joining the developer program and you join subscription may not be shown immediately. Wait for five, 10 minutes, the instant sandbox will be appeared after five, 10 minutes. If you get any error also, don't hurry. Thank you. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and support